So finally some great news for XRP in the SEC versus Ripple court case following a month of a downward trend. This is something holders will be happy about. What is up guys? Welcome back to your daily source of news on all things crypto and make sure you stay till the end for my XRP price prediction. In today's news XRP is sitting at 0.6373 up 3.19% for the past 24 hours. XRP has seen some uh an upward trend for the past 24 hours jumping from the point of 0.61 to the highest point of 0.65 a decent decent price jump uh that is following a constant downward trend throughout the month and this is really something we needed guys uh it's some positivity in the xrp community so Here's the latest about SEC versus Ripple for XRP investors to know. A new filing has been submitted by Matthew C. Solomon on behalf of Ripple and its defendants. The largest filing sees Ripple call out SEC's delay tactics while opposing the latter's request to file additional briefs on privileged assertions. The SEC versus XRP legal battle continues to gather interest with the latest developments. Ripple stated in, an, in a note that SEC requests leave to file what they term a reply, but, the, uh, but this would be at least the SEC's sixth filing in a position to defendants. At this point, the SEC has had more than ample opportunity to assert and support its various privilege assertions. Discovery closed months ago and the parties are on the eve of filing motions for summary judgment. Further delay is prejudicial to defendants. The SEC, however, continues to uphold the disclosure of the documents. The note further stated the SEC now claims that the last year of briefings, oral argument, the court's decisions, and their motion for reconsideration were all an academic exercise because it turns out that the documents are privileged attorney client communications. In late April, the SEC filed a motion to renew its assertion that the attorney-client privilege protects internal documents related to a 14th of June 2018 speech delivered by Bill Henman, the then director of the SEC's Division of Co Corporate Finance. According to James K. Filan, Ripple defendants have requested an extension until 13th of May. This extension is in response to SEC's renewed assertions or the former SEC officials' emails. A bright Q1 for Ripple. Amid SEC tensions, Ripple published a report on its performance during Q1 of 2022. The report suggested healthy growth for XRP despite the ongoing SEC battle and macroeconomic and geopolitical headwinds. The quarter saw record-breaking growth for ODL with an 8x year-on-year -year increase. RippleNet also marked a new milestone, touching the $15 billion annualized payment volume run rate with consumers with customers ODL for several use cases. Another development was observed for this quarter, focusing on increased operability. The XRP Ledger saw cross-bridge integrations with multi-chain and all bridge, allowing XRP holders to move their assets to 12 blockchains so finally some great news to hear after this uh, very bearish month for xrp uh this coin has a lot of lot of potential but the bearish news just keep coming uh over the past few weeks and that's been driving the price all the way down to the 0.60 mark where it's been hovering for the past week or so and guys, I think this is a great, great time to be investing into XRP. I don't think uh, it will break the 0.60 resistance as it was never really quite able to. Every time it dropped down in value, it dropped to this point and no further. So I would say, guys, invest now because you will be seeing some massive profits once the court case concludes. So guys, that's it for today's news. Come back tomorrow.